We are in Hofors at the uh, Ovaco steel mill, where they produce uh, roughly 350,000 ton of uh, steel every year. Harsko Environmental has together with Volvo a joint project here at uh, Ovaco in Hofors to transport material in autonomous and electrified mode. I mean, for us, it's a great opportunity to be the first to test it on a commercial basis. Volvo has learned a lot, I think, from our experience to, to work as a service provider. And for us as a service provider, it has been very good to work with Volvo to align in all the new challenges this system drives. I definitely see a place for electrified and autonomous machines within our working area, definitely. We need to be super efficient, we need to be super smart regarding the environmental and we need to be in front of the, the legislation. We knew what we wanted to have and I think we have achieved almost everything of it when we're looking at all the benefits. Then for sure all the learnings is from a technical perspective that we will bring with us for the future. The energy consumption is a clear benefit for us, uh, which has been proven in this project. We are a company that has a target to reduce the carbon footprint for year by year in the future. This is one step of that. Automation has historically always uh, led to growth. That will be the case for transport system as well, especially in our industry. Now this system is working on a confined area. We have perfect control of the machines. The next step for this is how to interact with the other uh, traffic. We can see that the commercial system is, is, is working and uh, for sure it will be very interesting for the future to continue with this uh, joint cooperation between Volvo and Harsko. I think we are very close to be able to scale it up and it has proven the, the importance of having a close collaboration between the two parties. Looking back to this project, I am definitely convinced that autonomous solutions and electrified machines have a place in the future.